Hello, this is Edwin Edebiri, your Chief Happiness Officer. Folks, I am so excited today for, you know, to bring to you Nancy back. Now, I know some of you are wondering, you know, when it comes to voices, you know, it's a big business thing. I'm just small little business. Why do I need that? Well, guess what? You are, I have a treat for you. You are in for something very exciting. Nancy. Tell us a little bit about how did you get to voice your choice? Well, actually, it was years ago uh, when I was seven years old. I loved to sing. In fact, singing made me, made me happy. I was very, uh, that was my passion. I was a very, very shy person. So I, I joined various choirs. I, as I got older, I went into freelance singing. I was... Um, singing for opening and closing special events. I did weddings and funerals. And then I decided to do some stage acting. So I did musicals and I really enjoyed them. And then I said, hey, why don't I get paid for this again? So I decided to uh, start acting. I start with background work and then I went into on camera work. And that was so fun with me. And then I said, how about voiceover? So then I, I w took some training and then I, I, uh, I said, this is great. Then I'll use the mic. I'll be using the mic close up or far apart. And, I, and then I, I decided with the training, I found out how to construct a professional studio, professionally sound booth. And I got it all together. So now I am ready. I'm ready to help <laughs> your business. Voice your choice. That's the word, yes. right? Now, yes. now, in between all of this, I know you went to Smith to Spain to sing also, right? Yes. And, and now you are auditing for some musical stuff for Christmas? Yes, I am. As a matter of fact, um, I sing in a community choir with the orchestra. It's the Chattanooga Opera and uh, Symphony and Opera Chorus. And wow. we we sing um we're right now we're doing the musical the actual um christmas part of handel's messiah wow and, and also we'll be doing mozart's requiem so when people say well what kind of singing do you do i said well i do anything for between um motown and mozart <laughs> <laughs> so you cover all the garbage <laughs> yes absolutely <laughs> that I is so cool that is I so enjoy cool. it so Love so it. let me let, let, let me let me ask you this though so if a person um hearing us right now and they're kind of getting curious what kind of benefits you know they will get from using your services give me three three benefits that they will get from using your service well, one of the business, the benefits would be uh, spoofing up their website. Maybe they just have uh, pictures of their building or, or their, uh, their workstations, what have you. I would be the voice to your website and bring it up to make it more interesting. Also, if uh, you had visitors to, to call your business up, instead of listening to all the music, how about lending a voice to that? Wow. Say you've got a special going on. I could be telling you about a special instead of you saying, oh, there's that music again, just putting it down. <laughs> you can listen to my voice and I can tell you about specials going on with your business. Wow. Or if you are in a situation where you need somebody to tell you or uh, be the voice over for a commercial that you have, provided like like on television you've got a movie netflix and there's a a commercial that goes on and that then that commercial would be my voice or maybe even the image of me talking about your business that what is so that? cool that is so cool now i know some of you are listening to this right now i say oh i'm just a small tiny business it's, you know this stuff she's talking about is for the big businesses I remember when I first got into business, you know, and 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 there, there was a big difference between doing a black and white brochure and doing a color brochure. And people thought color was so expensive. And so they just blocked their mind out of it. 
until they go and try it and say, wait a second, this thing is not that expensive. And it makes a world of difference to your business. Exactly. So if you are getting caught thinking voiceover, that's big people, you got to try it, man. You got to, you got to at least reach out to Nancy. Nancy, when they reach out to you, what should they expect? How, how do you bring them on board into this? Well, they would either contact me by phone or through an email. And then we would sit down and we would do a discovery call. Then I would find out where, what, what is their revenue what, or how they would, uh, what exactly what their needs are. You know, wow. I would do a needs analysis because wow. it's all about the customer. Is Absolutely. I'm here to help you. Absolutely. And folks, let me put it this way. You don't know what you don't know. Okay. That's correct. You know, maybe, so, <laughs> so, maybe so, something will come out of the, the conversation that say, oh, I never thought about that. Yeah. And I can help them. I could take them through a channel or, uh, or maybe a different way, another perspective uh, to help them, to help engage them, to kind of like get the mind going. Wow. Folks, well, again, I just want to encourage you. You definitely want to reach out to Nancy because she will expand your mind, okay? And expand your you. business. And, <laughs> <laughs> that's a good way to stop it right there. Thank you, Nancy, for being here. And I think this is a lot of fun. Hey. <laughs> and thank this you. Is, this is Edwin Devery, your Chief Happiness Officer. Stay happy.